In other videos in this series, you can see how TopBraid Enterprise Vocabulary Net's user interface makes it easy for a multi-user team to manage a network of interconnected vocabularies. In this video, we'll see an example of how TopBraid EVN, acting as a background vocabulary server, can help other applications do their jobs more effectively. In this case, we'll see how TopBraid EVN can enhance search. First, we'll see a simple search application do some plain and some enhanced searches of a collection of medical advice. Then, we'll learn about the role that TopBraid EVN plays to help that search application get more useful results from the document collection. We'll find out how TopRate EVN uses semantic information about this data to improve the searches. And finally, we'll learn how you can improve the performance of your search applications with TopRate EVN. This web form accepts a search term and passes it along to the website at Medline Plus, a service of the U.S. National Library of Medicine. With the Unenhanced Radio button selected, as shown here, the form passes along the search term with no modifications. Here, I'm entering a common misspelling of the word ibuprofen, ending it with IN instead of EN. The form sends the search term to the Medline Plus website, which finds only one occurrence of the term. If we return to the search form and perform the same search with the Auto Enhanced radio button selected, the enhancement process converts the search into a search for documents that contain either the entered term or the correct spelling of ibuprofen, which gets plenty of hits. In addition to common misspellings, this auto-enhancement process can also recognize alternative terms such as brand names. Here, a search for the brand name Motrin gets converted into a search for Motrin or ibuprofen, because all information about the effects of ibuprofen would probably be helpful to someone interested in the effects of Motrin. Slang terms are another form of alternative term. The search enhancement converts a search for joy powder into one that also searches for morphine. As we'll see, the data used to enhance these searches is from the medical domain and can be used to disambiguate vague terms. An auto-enhanced search for SALT presents a choice of two terms that SALT may refer to in a medical context, with each being a hypertext link to a search for that term. What if your search gets some hits, but you want to explore information connected to potentially related terms? One option with this search application is to ask for terms that are broader than your search term. A search for terms broader than ibuprofen shows that it belongs to categories such as non-steroidal, anti-inflammatory drugs, and propionic acids. The search application displays both as links to searches for those terms. Perhaps your search gets too many hits, and you want some help narrowing them down. For example, an unenhanced search for steroids gets over 1,400 hits. A search on narrower terms for steroids shows two classes of them, both as hypertext links to information about those classes. Another way to find related information is by selecting related terms on the search application's web form. Searching for information related to ibuprofen gets a broad range of terms to select from, all displayed as hypertext links to searches for those terms. How do these searches get enhanced on their way to Medline Plus? When the Unenhanced radio button is selected, a search gets sent directly to the medical information website, but when one of the other radio buttons is selected, the search application sends a request for relevant information to TopRate EVN. It then uses the returned information to build an enhanced version of the search to send to the medical information website. TopRate EVN can easily communicate with other processes and take advantage of available data to enhance the requests because it supports all the relevant W3C semantic web and linked data standards. To build the sample application we've seen here, we first retrieved RDF data about the World Health Organization's list of essential medicines from the Sparkle endpoint on the DBpedia website 
into top rate EVN. The script accompanying the web form in the demo search application can then send Sparkle queries to top rate EVN asking, for example, if a given term is an alternative to a particular preferred term that should be included in the search, or if there are narrower, broader, or related terms that can be included in the search result. This application asked for results in the JSON format, but top rate EVN can deliver any of the standard Sparkle result formats, or even custom formats if necessary. While it's impractical to store the complete meaning of all of the terms in a machine-readable way, TopBraid EVN's ability to store metadata about the terms such as the relationships between preferred and alternative terms or between broader and narrower terms means that you're storing part of the semantics of these terms, and these semantics can help your applications get more out of the data that they're working with. How can you take advantage of semantic technology to improve search operations in your applications in enterprise. Take an inventory of available data that can help. DBpedia is one source. Industry associations and standards groups often have structured data that can help. Potentially useful data inside your company can include both structured data and metadata about your business domain as well as search logs, which tell you a lot about what people are searching for and how they're doing it. Take a good look at the options available in the search engine you're using. Many people limit themselves to simple keyword searches without knowing that Boolean operators and other syntax options are available to let them, or to let a search enhancement application working behind the scenes, assemble richer, more sophisticated searches. Finally, look into tools that let you take the best advantage of the data you've gathered to enhance your searches. You'll want standard support so that you can take advantage of a wide range of available data and integrate the tool with your other systems easily. You'll want a flexible data model that can take advantage of many different potential relationships that may be used to describe the semantics of your saved search metadata. And you'll want a simple user interface that lets staff members without a strong technology background curate that metadata. Top rate EVNs web-based interface makes it easy for a work group to collaborate on the management of distributed vocabularies to support the applications in your enterprise. The medical information search application that we just saw was a very simple example of how top braid EVN can improve the value of an application. In this case, a simple web-based search front end. Top braid EVN offers a range of both simple and sophisticated options for integrating with a variety of other applications in a service-oriented architecture to help your curated vocabulary data and metadata provide the best possible support to those applications. Along with its intuitive interface and easy integration with other systems, TopRate EVN has many other features that make it the ideal solution for the management of taxonomies, thesauruses, code lists, ontologies, and other vocabularies. In this video, we saw how top rate EVN can take advantage of standards-based semantics to make a simple search application much more powerful. We also learned how it can integrate with other search and non-search applications to help you get more value out of your vocabulary data and metadata. If you'd like to try top rate EVN yourself, let us know at evn underscore demo at topquadrant.com and we can set up your own remote demo installation for your team to try out with their own data. Or, if you'd just like to chat about the possibilities, we'd be happy to discuss how Top Quadrant solutions can help you turn your vocabularies and other structured and unstructured information assets into a semantic ecosystem, the next step in data evolution.